you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another BTS reaction video. Do you know, we're actually approaching my year's anniversary for BTS. Um, I believe it was the 28th of January 2022, which was my first ever reaction to BTS. A lot of people have told me to go back and react to that um, reaction. I haven't actually watched it since I recorded it, so that might be a good idea. If you guys would like to see it, let me know. But, funny story. Uh, Microcosmos, this was actually the song that I would say officially made me army. This was the song that I cried at. The first ever song I cried at ages ago. And it was when I reacted to their full live performance. It's like a 50 minute long video. I sat down and reacted to the whole thing. And this song was just a snippet in there. Um, <clears throat> and I remember listening to it. And a lot of you recently have told me to go back and check out the full live version of this song. And do a genuine first time, I guess, reaction to the song on its own. Like the sole reaction to the song. Which is what we're going to do right now. So, that's what we're going to do. I remember crying to this when I checked it out. Uh, I haven't got any less emotional, so who knows? Um, make sure you subscribe so you can enter into our channel giveaway when we hit 300,000 subscribers. Other than that, sit back, relax, get comfortable, get ready to see, get ready to see me get emotional. Let's jump into my first time reaction to BTS Microcosmos Live. Mm. <laughs> Let's go. I'm not surviving! I'm not surviving! <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm not surviving! I'm not surviving! I'm not surviving! Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! I was like, I'll be fine, I'll be fine. What's wrong with me? They haven't even started singing yet. JK's literally just opened his mouth. Why? <laughs> Why? Why? I dad, what? Why? Why? What is this song? Why does it do this? And they haven't even. Come on! I hope you're ready for a very emotional reaction. <laughs> I have to pause for copyright reasons. I just want to see him react to the whole thing. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know why I get so emotional. This is the first song by BTS that made me cry. You know, first ever song. This one right here that we're reacting to right now. I did the full reaction to the live performance. This song came on and for some reason it got tears out of me. And I couldn't even work out why. Um, <clears throat> I don't know why. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Something about this song just hits me hard, man. It just hits me hard. I don't know. I'm just sitting here looking at these seven amazing men. And do you know what's going through my head? Is BTS make me proud to be me. You know, BTS make me proud to be me. This big emotional um, like softy. And uh, BTS make me proud. And I've had comments in the past, um, even from my own Vava, about like, like, you know, being a too emotional 
and I've 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 never changed. I've always been the same. Even even with my own father telling me I, it was wrong, <laughs> and I, I've never changed because I feel like, and I want this message to be put on my sons as well as they're growing up. There is nothing wrong with being who you want to be. There is nothing wrong wrong with being who you are, and there is nothing wrong with showing how you really feel. It, there's nothing wrong with that. And I don't give a fuck what anyone says. That is a message that I will install on my sons. So they can grow up with a father that is proud of who they are and know what I grew up with. RM handing over to Sugar is just awesome. Whenever they do it in any song, it's just amazing to see. Uh, like, just they're two of my favorite world rappers on this planet, and whenever they do just a handover, simple as it is, it's, it's just awesome. Him so much. I love him so much. Do you know what I love so much? We did a big BTS Friday recently. We checked out the first episode of Is It Burn the Stage? And literally in that, you see them all sitting down and talking about how they want to be more real, how they want to show more of themselves, how they want to make sure that Army and the world sees them for who they really are behind the camera on stage, sees the real true BTS. How many people on this planet do that? It's something I've always tried to do on this channel. And it's something BTS have inspired me to make sure I do more of. And it's being real. It's being genuine. It's being the same off camera as you are on camera. And BTS do it better than anyone else I've ever seen. Just being themselves. And it, just watching them and seeing them. It's just how, You just can't help but love these guys so much for that. They're a fucking inspiration. <laughs> I saw a recent interview. Every interview I've ever seen of Jin's, I just want to say this is funny. I saw another recent one. Every interview I ever see of that man, they're like, so what do you do? You know, what's your thing? And he's like, my job is to have the most handsome face in the world. He's like, I'm the handsome one of BTS. I fucking love Jin so much. Oh, why did I do this to myself? Why did I do this to myself? This was voted for by all of you on Twitch, by the way. 
um, every Thursday's live stream, we do a live reaction live stream on Twitch. And at the end of that live stream, all of the viewers get to vote on which BTS song uh, they would like as like a bonus song for the um, for the week. Um, uh, Microcosmos, this one, um, along with Lights, I think. Lights came a close second, so I'm going to react to both of them. I'll probably do Lights in two days' time. You'll see that on Thursday. <laughs> Um, but yeah, this one, and even when I saw it, people told me to react to the Jimmy Fallon one, a couple of people, but I thought this one would be better. Um, but yeah, if you want to be part of those votes, every single Thursday on Twitch at the end of the live streams, we do a vote for a bonus BTS song. Um, so if you want to just follow me on Twitch, link in the description, you can join us for those. This Thursday, um, the, the most recent one we had actually, uh, was our most active, um, vote. It had like over a hundred votes, which was our most active BTS vote. <clears throat> Yeah, it seemed like loads of people were really excited about it. And we, and we, yeah, we do live reactions to the whole live stream as well. But yeah, anyway, anyway, um, Microcosmos was literally like, when I saw it come up, I was like, this is this is the song that got me, right? This is the song that got me. I can't believe how close we're coming around. And, and at the time of recording this, it'll be eight days since my, um, f like in a year, since since my first time BTS reaction. What a journey. What, an, what a journey we've been on. I can't believe it was that long ago. What an incredible journey. I feel like BTS literally opened the door for me to a whole world of music. I, I like before that I was reacting to loads of stuff from Pentatonix to Dimash and that sort of stuff. But I feel like with BTS, it literally just opened everything. BTS was the gateway that led me into every single K-pop group, and then Japanese music, and then anime music, and then the world of music. And it was just like because in, in reacting to BTS. I discovered a whole fan base from across the world of different music from different countries that wanted to recommend music from their home countries and everything. And it just spread. And I just went into this reaction journey with an open mind thinking, all right, I'll listen to whatever people recommend. I'm happy to listen to it. So let's go. Let's go on this journey together. And I stayed open minded. And it's just been incredible. Ah, oh, it's been incredible. I can't believe I'm in this position. A year later. This is my job now. I don't deserve it. I just sit here and watch videos. I don't get it. I can't believe it. Oh, man. Ah, sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's just been... A, it's just been an amazing journey. I owe BTS so much, you know. Ah... <laughs> oh. Their music, I never realised how much I needed it. And just having... <laughs> the fact that, like, the biggest group on this planet is just themselves, is just so awesome. Isn't that just amazing? The biggest group on this planet doesn't have a front or a face. They're genuine. How cool is that? <laughs> How cool is that? What what a message and an inspiration for the for the generations to come to just be yourself. Just be yourself. You're only here once. You're only here once. Just be yourself. It's your life. Don't live someone else's. Live your own. And if you don't take my word for it, take BTS's. You've got seven men who live their own lives, who are themselves, and who are wear their emotions on their sleeve and are themselves for the whole world to see. Such, they've, just seeing that and seeing them with such a huge audience, being themselves and being so genuine just inspired me to double down into it, to make sure that I didn't hide things from the camera, that I showed everyone things that if I was ever emotional and I thought about cutting it, I didn't. And I kept everything raw. Nearly every reaction I ever record is a first take. Every single one. I press record and I just go. I don't cut it and trim it and, and like I like other reaction channels where you'll see like they're, they're here and then they're over here and then they're over here. I don't do that. I, it's just it's just me pressing record and talking. And I owe BTS for, for just making me believe in that. Man, I love these guys so much. And I really mean it when I say those words. I do. I do. There's something different about them, and there's they, they make me. They just make me feel like no other group on this planet. I love them so much. They're incredible. I owe them so much, and all of you, all of you. I owe you guys all so much. Thank you so much for supporting me. I can't believe I'm doing this right now, and it's only possible because of you. 
It's only because possible because you watch my videos, because you follow me on my socials, because because you support me. It's that's the only reason this is possible. Otherwise, I'd just be working in an office still and being sad and missing out on my children growing up because I'm coming home just as they're going to bed every day and and, and not getting to know my sons. And because of all of you, I get to be <laughs> I get to be a dad that is a million times better than the one I had, and I get to be proud of myself. And I get to like go to bed and I get to lie there and think like, I'm the best dad in the world. And and I only get to think that because of all of you. Thank you so much. I love all of you so much. You're incredible. I won't be able to reply to every comment on this video, but I'll, I'll, I'll try and read as many as I can. And I'll reply to as many as I can, like I do every video. And I hope you all understand that. If I don't reply to your comment, I apologize, but I, I try my best. and I really love all of you. Thank you so much for supporting me. I've been nothing without all of you. Anyway, I'm going to end the video because I'm very emotional. And I hope wherever you are in the world, you have an absolutely incredible day. As always, my friends, you see me in the next video.